What's going on, everyone? Mike back, showing off some Richie Ashburn pickups. Richie Ashburn's a Phillies Hall of Famer. Picked up some slabs, actually decided a little while ago to do the set registry. Just seemed to make sense. Richie Ashburn, legendary Phillies player, broadcaster I grew up listening to. He's a Hall of Famer, and quite honestly, he's super affordable. So here's a 1954 Tops and a PSA 5. Really awesome card, just looks awesome. Love that little photo in black and white to the left, the portrait. Really nice design. Love the old school logo up there in the top left corner. So beautiful looking card. Super happy to add this one in a slabbed version to the collection. And the set registries are pretty cool. I'm not like super into them like some of the guys on here. I'm not too worried about doing a bunch of sets, but I do think if you're going to do some player collecting, it's a great way to kind of have a checklist and keep track of what you have. So it's neat. Um, and obviously set registries are very popular. They're cool. I just don't worry about kind of logging all that information and following all the sets. But again, wonderful idea and it's worked wonders for PSA. So that's a nice Ashburn pickup there. Also picked up in 1957. 57's one of my favorite designs. Just love the simplicity of it. Love the photos. Looks great. This is a PSA 3, so a lower grade. And while I'd love to get this in like a 6 or a 7, that'd be great. They're a little pricey. And when I have seen ones in a higher grade, they're off center more than I'd like. So this one, centering is far from perfect, but it does look pretty decent doesn't really bother me the centering it doesn't stand out and honestly i got this in a lot with two other cards so it cost me about four dollars so i could not turn that down at all um, certainly to me has great eye appeal i already have one of these cards in the collection in my binder uh, phillies binder so just wanted to add a slabbed one and hey if i come across another nice looking card higher grade i'll consider picking it up why not so Ashburn, after his Phillies days, did spend a couple years with the Cubs and then a year or so with the Mets. So this is the 61 tops in the Cubs uni. It's a PSA 6. So it's a nice card overall. 61, I don't mind the design. Uh, this one's okay, but overall it's not one of my favorite sets because there's just so many portraits and a lot of them, I don't know, just don't stand out too well. There's ones with guys without their hats. Hap Thankfully, uh, Ashburn is wearing the Cubs hat here, so you can actually tell he's on the Cubs. So it's a nice pickup there. This one is uh, a little interesting. It's the 62 Tops. It's a Mets card. And to me, it is not one of Ashburn's best-looking cards at all. Uh, this is a five and a half. Excellent plus. It's just, you can't tell what uniform he's wearing there. It kind of has that expression with his lips and tongue. It's, hey, it probably wasn't the number one choice to use that year for the photograph, but that's the card they made. So that's the card I picked up. 62 Tops Ashburn. It's just, uh, it's just interesting. Sometimes you just look at it and you're like, what were they thinking? But, Still happy to pick it up. And then the final one to round off this group of pickups is the 1963 Tops. This one, you can actually see him in the Mets uniform. You see him with the Mets hat, of course. Got the little logo or photo down there to the right. Richie Ashburn, New York Mets outfield. So it's a PSA 7. It's a solid little grade there. And, hey, I'd prefer him to have been a lifelong Philly but that's not the way his career unfolded. You're going to pick up all the cards. I'm uh, getting there. I've got most of them. The big one, which is going to be the one that's going to be the toughest to pick up, will be that rookie card. I've been following them, but there haven't been a whole lot available for sale. So I'll keep my eye on it, and hopefully by the end of the year be able to pick it up. All right, comment down below. Let me know what you think. Which one is your favorite, Ashburn, and which is your least favorite? This is my vote for least favorite. You got the Cubs one, which is pretty neat. The 57 tops, which I'm a huge fan of, and 54. It's hard for me to des decide which do I like better, that 54 or the 57. Bigger fan of the 57 set, but this card really pops to me. Let me know what you think. Hit the like button, subscribe, and I will talk to you next time. Have a great one.